so excited about this week and seeing what I can see. Focusing and taking... Ah, it's Aaron! Well, hello, kids. Good morning. Aaron, how are you? Can you believe we're already at Wednesday? I cannot. I've been having such a great time this week. It's been so fun. It is awesome. It is awesome. All right. Well, today we have lots to look forward to. We've got some games again. We've got arts and crafts with Miss Mindy again. What are we making? Are we making a, is it a camera? A storybook film strip. Oh, I'm goodness. looking forward to finding out more about that. What about you guys? Yeah. Today, boys and girls, we have a great story about Jesus and how he died for us and then came alive again. And that fits right in with our Bible verse. Let us keep, keep looking, looking to, to Jesus. Jesus. Yeah, because after all, God, God made me, me. God, God loves me. me, and Jesus wants to be our friend forever. Let's worship together, yeah, you guys, I'm and jump into forward the day. To, to a dance. Here we go. Thanks, Aaron. We'll see you soon. Back to you, kids. See you in a minute. Anything different about me? Glasses! I'm wearing glasses! My friend Zenny got a new pair to help her see better. I thought that they were so cool, so I wanted some too. But here's a secret lean in close. There's no glass in my glasses, they're not real. Glasses are awesome. Look at this pair. This pair makes me want to read. Let us keep looking to Jesus, Hebrews 12 2. 
or this pair. This pair makes you want to dance. Oh, and look at this fun pair. I can make silly faces with them and make people laugh. Yup, glasses are the best. Hoo, hoo. Hey, it's Ollie. Hello, Harper. Hoo, hoo. Seeing new things, are you? Hi, Ollie. I wish I wore glasses for real. It's fun to see new things, it's true. And I know more that you can see and do. So let's hear this story. Just follow me through. Who? Follow Ooh. me through. Follow me through who? Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. Well, hello, friends. I'm Casey. Welcome to Look and See, the place where we look and we look and we see what's in the Bible. Are you ready to look inside the mystery box and see what we can learn from the Bible today? If you're ready, on the count of three, yell, take a look! Ready? One, two, three! Take a look! Whoa! A chef hat, an apron, marshmallows, rolls! Looks like we're going to be cooking today. <laughs> We've been learning about our good friend Jesus and how we can look in the Bible to see some of the amazing things Jesus did. We're going to make one of my favorite treats. When we make this treat, it helps us take a closer look at our story. When I learned to bake this treat, I learned more about Jesus. Let's look in the cookbook. <laughs> no, silly. Let's look in the Bible to learn about the most amazing thing our friend Jesus ever did for you and for me. One day, Jesus and his friends were eating dinner. Can you pretend to eat like this? Good job! While they were eating, Jesus told his friends he was going to go away, but not to worry, because he was going to come back so he could be our friend forever. Give yourself a hug like a friend does. <laughs> awesome! That night, some angry people came. Oh no, show me your angry face. Whoa, those are some angry faces. The angry people came and took Jesus away. Then they hurt Jesus and he died. After he died, his friends wrapped him in a cloth and put him in a tomb. Jesus' friends were very, very, very sad. Three days went by. It felt like a long time. Kind of like when you're waiting for your treats to bake. Can you count the days with me? Ready? One, two, three! <laughs> On the third day, some of Jesus' friends went to the tomb. But guess what they found? Nothing! There was nothing in the tomb, just like there's nothing inside my treat. It was empty. What? The tomb was empty? Jesus was not in there anymore. He was alive. He went to visit some of his friends to tell them he was back and wanted to be their friend forever. Everyone celebrate! <laughs> He said he would. He came back so he could be our friend forever. Give yourself a hug just like a friend does. Great job. Jesus wants to be my friend forever and your friend forever and your friend forever and your friend forever and your friend forever. And your friend forever. <laughs> oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? 
Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Yes, it's true. Now, let's hear it from you. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you tomorrow for another look and see. Bye! <laughs> so there's your story. And it's all true. Jesus is alive for me and for you. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? That's amazing. Jesus did something that no one else could do so he could be our friend forever. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good. Glasses are super fun, but whether I'm wearing them or not, I can still see that Jesus wants to be my friend forever. That makes me so happy. I think I'm gonna have another dance party. See you next time, bye! Let us keep looking to Jesus, Hebrews 12, 2. Let us keep looking to Jesus, Hebrews 12, 2. All right, welcome to game time, everyone. It's Coach Rob. Today, we have an extra fun game involving water, a water race. So you're gonna get into teams or get your own bucket. We have a bucket here that's full of water. And what you're gonna do is fill your cu the cup that you have with the water in this bucket. Then try to go as quickly as you can over to this bucket. And the game will go for two minutes and whoever has the most water in their bucket at the end of those two minutes is the winner. All right, is everyone ready? Yeah. On my whistle. One, two, three. Go, 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 go. Try not to spill that water. And then put it in that bucket. Go, 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 go
And so I want you to take your time and uh, colored pencils might work well on this since it's a little smaller, but decorate it, color it in however you want. You can color your numbers. And don't forget, you can even color the squares in just like that. And for Jesus, I'm just gonna have fun and give him green hair, I think. So, so you're gonna decorate and then take scissors and cut off on the dotted lines, the side stripes. And once it's all colored in, you're going to slide it right through your camera lens like so. And, whoop, getting there. You might have to make sure to cut that. There you go, just like that. And then you can slide it back and forth and remember the order of this story. And remember, Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Bye guys. All right, boys and girls, what an incredible day we have had. I, I don't know what I did with my camera. Can I borrow your camera? That was so much fun to make those, wasn't it, Aaron? It was so much fun. And I wonder, Eric, who won y'all's fill the bucket game? Ooh, the bucket race. I hope y'all had some great competition today. It's so much fun. And we have the opportunity to display good sportsmanship, right? That's right. Always important. Very important. Yeah. So we had a great Bible story today. Yeah, we we learned about Jesus and the great thing that he did for us and how he came back to life. Amazing. So great. And what is our memory verse again, Eric? The memory verse is... Let us look to Jesus. Let us keep looking to Jesus. Wow. And you know why we do that, boys and girls? It's because God, he made us and he loves us. us. And Jesus wants to be our friend forever. Yeah. I think it's so cool that we can be friends with God. How amazing his love is for us. So uh, we're wrapping the day up. We've got another worship dance video. So we're excited about that. And then we'll be back tomorrow, but it's going to be Thursday tomorrow. Can't believe it. Oh, let's dance. Do, 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 do. See you tomorrow, boys and girls. Take care.